Okay, I had this uh, outside for a little while uh, and it was spinning quite well. Uh, right now I just have one rotor on it. Uh, I'm getting about 6 volts which is not quite enough for my purpose so it will probably need another magnet plate that will make it slightly more complicated so what I might do is just I might go back to the ceiling fan motor I'm gonna put bigger blades on this maybe drag tight blades that would have more torque and uh, gonna hold off on this axial flux setup because uh, I think I might uh, I might do better with blades that have more torque than this one It seems that I can't make up my mind. I'm going back and forth between the uh, axial flux and the regular ceiling fan motor. The uh, axial flux is is okay. It can turn with uh, a single blade like this, but uh, I'm short a few volts. Uh, maybe with a two magnet plates I can get up to 12 volts but still that's a little short so I might go back to this regular ceiling fan uh, setup except uh, the blade that I have is not that great um, it's the wrong size it's a 1x4 instead of a 2x4 so the pitch is not exactly right Uh, Muddy's uh, blades have uh, a bigger pitch. Uh, this will turn with the axial flux, but I don't think this will turn with the ceiling fan. I will have to, in addition to the uh, the pitch, I think I need another another blade, sort of like a instead of a single blade, I would have two long blades like this, making it. Uh, a four blade uh, wind turbine uh, so that's what I'm doing going back and forth so here's the inside of the ceiling fan motor is uh, these are one inch by one inch magnets actually I ran out of magnets uh, so I have these three-quarter inch uh, magnets there also so not running for office but I'm short a few volts with the uh, axial flux so let's see how this would work out with a ceiling fan <laughs> 